Um, this is uh, November 28th, 2022. My name is Jason Washburn and I'm an amateur filmmaker. And I really like to make films, science fiction, suspense. And I've been working on a film now for a couple years. And here's some of the set for the final scene. It's a film that has to do with the Great Reset, uh, based on ideas from the World Economic Forum, Klaus Schwab, Yuval Noah Harari, how these guys are talking about hacking the humans, that humans are now hackable, and that we can hack humans and we can control humans so that there's no longer an individual. This is a film how the good intentions of man go wrong. How people think that they can circumvent Mother Nature, they can play God, and in the process find out that no, they can't. That there's a real God who says no. You can only go so far because if you don't think or believe or understand that the universe is bigger than you, you're going to bite off more than you can chew. So, this is basically a, an idea taken off of that. And I've been making all kinds of sets and filming here, filming there, and then I get another idea. And then, next thing you know, a couple years goes by and I'm still thinking of another idea. And wow, I tell you, uh, it's a problem I have. Uh, things snowball in my brain, and I just love building sets, I love making stuff. Love digging in the trash and finding more stuff to use. And before I know it, I got a bunch of trash that I'm never going to use. It's like, wow, okay. So I'm trying to wind it down. This is going to be one of the last scenes. And uh, okay, so that's pretty much it for now. Um, I don't know. Hopefully, I'll get it edited. I don't know when, maybe in a year or so. Hopefully, soon. I've got too many irons on the fire right now. And this is one of them, you know, with work and kids and wife and a house and my own personal development and learning how to be balanced and all that jazz. Hey, it's not, it's not boring. So here we go. Uh, it's Jason Washburn here again, and I'm standing by um, the model that I've been working on for a while, which is a part of the film that I'm working on for a while. It's been a couple of years now. And uh, it's always fun to make models because, you know, I make a, a model and then in the process of time I get another idea about, hey, that model would look better if I did this, that, and the other thing. And so, as I said before, things tend to snowball on me and I end up spending a lot of time making another model or improving the model that I made. And it's fun. Uh, this is all stuff out of yogurt, milk things. Um, Lots of stuff I found in the garbage. You know, it's amazing how much props they're throwing away. And uh, everything here is tape and aluminum foil for duck, uh, duck ducking. Um, it's a lot of fun, and believe me, I like to do it. But it's like also what happens up here when I do it. Um, it's been a lesson in learning how to balance it out, having a, a, a measured approach, have a beginning, middle, and end, and have a cutoff date so that I don't do it some more and do it some more and do it some more which is something that I'm working on up here so this is pretty much it it was fun shooting this today we did it or I did it and I got it done I had to clear out a lot of stuff I had to move a lot of stuff around in order just to do these shoots I had to take out lights from the shed and put them in here I had to staple and hopefully the green screen will look okay this is filmmaking 101 plus and it's always complicated something always comes up in the process but it's a lot of fun because hopefully the end product which is only going to be a few seconds of what i shot here today hopefully it'll look good it'll be convincing so you can do some suspended disbelief and believe what you see on the screen even though it's all fake it's all green screen it was all shot in some in my room in a room in my house inside uh Hyatt film maryland us of a so this is it. Uh, we're moving on. I'm going to take it down and I'm going to go on to one last part of the film before I start editing. So, enjoy the film. 
Um, hello again. It's um, me doing the same old thing again. I had a an issue with the old green screen, or actually, I bought a new green screen from the five dollar store, and I thought, oh, this is going to be great. I'm going to use a new green screen. And it <clears throat> turned out that the, the new green screen wasn't the exact green that the Chrome key requires on my computer, so I put it in there. I did the Chrome key, and it's just didn't quite do a good uh, if you know what I mean you know zero out the green put in the background so I said wait a minute what's this you know five dollars you know at the store it's like how could they anyway I had to go back and get my old green screen out the one I got a long time ago <clears throat> at work and put it up there <clears throat> and I've got the wall painted and then in the process I'm adding on to the, the set as well. I'm adding on to the model. And so I added some stuff up there on the top. And you know, I changed the thing down at the bottom a little bit. So it's not the same as it was the last time I was talking to the camera. Okay, anyway, I got the new green screen up. I got lights up, up on the roof, down on the bed, on side to side. So there's a lot more light shining onto it. So I think it'll be a better resolve. But again... As it always is, it's filmmaking. Something always comes up. The green screen from the $5 store wasn't the exact right green color. So I had to do everything all over again. So, hey, welcome to Filming 101. Well, here I am again uh, with more of the set. I've been working on this last scene. Gee, the last scenes keep adding up as time goes on. It's like another last scene and oh gotta do this gotta do that and of course process got to do a couple more things and gosh it just keeps snowballing on me it never stops okay filmmaking one zero one it never stops there's always another idea after the last idea which wait a minute that sounds like a good idea and hey by the way so this is supposed to be the last part of the movie okay it's fun to do this i love making sets i love playing around with junk making it look cool and it's just what i like to do so here we go the last part of the movie uh the last scene of the last part of the movie <laughs> hi it's me again and uh i'm doing it at some more i did some shooting the last time and it was okay you know the came out okay but there's something about attention to detail how little things like the angles that should have been done differently that shouldn't have been so it didn't look as good as it could have been these kind of things entered in and again that that little wheel inside my head started to go round and around and around I'm thinking you know what I'm gonna do it again and Gosh, at work, I found some more stuff in the trash that looked really cool. I said, this has got to go in the film. And so I'm taking stuff out of the trash. And next thing you know, I'm adding on to it like before. But I really added on to it this time. Boy, I put a lot of stuff in. It's a lot different mm -hmm. than it was before. So a lot more to look at. Too much for the eye to focus in on at once, you know. So there's lots of little detail things here and there. And it's all junk, you know stuff from food wrapping and containers you put salad in at work and stuff for like desserts from the church uh pantry and stuff like that so i'm like thinking all right it's gonna be great now throwing some duct tape some electrical tape and i got these stickers out of the trash some years ago at the library of congress and i'm using those like it's going out of style hey it's great um so i got it all set up got the little guy and uh, it's a lot of fun. But like I said, you know, this kind of thing just gets going in my head and it won't stop. And like, wow, a couple weeks go by. I'm like, you know, I, I got to like have this balance out here. You know, put enough into it. It's time to set up. It's time to do the shoot. So I'm getting ready to do another shoot for the last scene of the movie, which I've been doing now for <laughs> a long time. So, okay, here I go again. Hope you guys enjoy it. Bye.